Canada has arrested Huawei's chief financial officer in Vancouver, where she is now facing extradition charges to the United States. To tell us more about this, we have with us Nazim. So, Nazim, tell us, uh, what has happened here? What's the larger picture? Uh, the official story is that uh, Huawei is accused of uh, violating sanctions, international uh, sanctions law uh, by exporting uh, products to Iran uh, and some other countries. Uh, however, it seems that there is a larger picture to this, which is that uh, the, the larger picture is the fact that Huawei is the world's largest uh, telecom equipment manufacturer. It manufactures routers, modems, switches, telecom tower, and so on. Uh, and it has uh, the U.S. has long been very concerned about its about the rise of Huawei, and the fact that uh, the Huawei products can be uh, used to uh, sort of in, in, in to indulge in uh, corporate or strategic national espionage. Uh, so this seems to be that this could be the uh, play in, uh, to try and get Huawei under uh, control which is uh, the national security advisor in the U.S. virtually confirmed this yesterday when he said that uh, the, the Huawei has long been on the radar of U.S. spy agencies and that they are very concerned about the rise. So it could be necessary, it could be related to that. Okay. So what's, what has been the uh, reaction from China then? Uh, China has obviously expressed uh, its outrage, uh, mm -hmm. saying that uh, the charges uh, against her are not clear and that uh, the CFO should be released immediately. Uh, the U.S. is yet to respond. Uh, but it seems that uh, the China is China is going to take this take this up very strongly. Okay. So how is this now going to impact the stock markets, and what does it mean for the U.S.-China trade war? Uh, there was uh, there was an immediate reaction just when the news broke, when the U.S. Uh, futures fell very sharply. Uh, but uh, since then, uh, it has been fairly uneventful. But if this does impact the ongoing trade war between the U.S. and China, it is going to take take a toll. Okay. Well, thanks a lot for that, Nazan. So this is basically a small development in an ongoing tech war. For more news and updates, log on to moneycontrol.com.